The superintendent says if the COVID-19 positivity rate goes above 10%, he will recommend full-time e-learning to be approved by the school board. The key to ending this pandemic, create an effective vaccine and give it to as many people as possible. And within a matter of days, an important step will be taken at the University of Illinois, Chicago. Researchers there will be giving trial vaccines to a thousand people. Joining us now is the lead investigator of the clinical trial, Dr. Richard Novak. Thank you, doctor, for joining us. Let's start with this. Where are you on the trial? Do you have the vaccine ready to administer? Well, actually, no, we don't have it in house yet. We're still waiting for the, del the delivery and we are still missing a few uh, pieces to get the vaccine trial up and running. Now, early small trials show promise. If you have test results similar to those, what will happen next and how soon will that phase occur? Well, we, we uh, anticipate that the study will go for a minimum of uh, six months. It's scheduled for two years. Uh, it really is dependent on how many cases we actually get in the in the vaccine participants because, as you know, the study is designed so that half the people will get a placebo, which is salt water, and the other half will get a vaccine. And uh, in the end, we want to see fewer cases of infection in the vaccine recipients than the placebo. But in order for us to see that, we have to see a certain number of infections. So the rate of new infections is largely going to drive how quickly we get the answer to this study. Yeah, you mentioning there the cases. Do you foresee any delay because you haven't gotten the vaccine yet? Uh, it's possible that we'll get a delay. I mean, we're, we're largely dependent on on the uh, government and Moderna to uh, get the study up and running for us. We're we're raring to go here at, at UIC, but uh, we need uh, all the them to provide us all the materials we need to get going. Well, you have a lot of people raring to sign up. You've already had thousands of people do just that to get the trial vaccine. Who and how are you determining who gets it? Uh, well, there's uh, there are certain criteria that we're looking for in people to for them to participate. We do have many thousands of people who are interested. Uh, we're trying to find people who are particularly at risk for getting COVID-19 disease uh, by virtue of uh, the part of town they live in or what kind of work they do or uh, their living situation. And also we're, we're uh, looking for people who, if they get COVID-19 disease, do they get really sick with it? So mm. we're, we're looking at a group of people who are older or possibly not as old, but have some underlying illness in a, in at least in a subgroup of the people who enroll. Okay, and I want to end with this, Doctor. You and just a few other researchers are at the center of what could be a huge change in the world amidst this pandemic. Have you had a chance to really soak that in, thinking about what you are a part of? Well, we're excited to be part of the study, but it's a tremendous amount of work. We've been, all my staff and I have been very involved in getting prepared to do this study, and so it's a 24 7 occupation. But uh, we're excited because we're very hopeful that this trial will uh, be successful. Yeah, well, thank you, Dr. Novak, for your time, your research, your talents, and we're pulling for you there at UIC and your entire team. Thank you very much.